Good, Good morning. Good morning. Eight yeah. o'clock. All right, it's 818 right now. Thousands are showing up at the Rose Bowl this morning, but not to watch football. Yep, they're ready to walk. It's all for a good cause, a walk to end epilepsy. And we're very excited. Joining us this morning, along with his family, is UCLA quarterback Brett Hundley. Good morning, Brett. Good morning. How you doing? You know what? We're great. You're probably tired. And congratulations on the, on the game. And you've got your um, family with you as well. Yeah, yeah, they're here. They're here at the at the walk. You know, my sister, my mom, and we're all here to support the cause. It's very, it's very interesting to see a younger person like yourself getting involved with awareness about uh, epilepsy. Why, why did you choose to get involved in this? Uh, it's, it's a, it's a good cause. You know, uh, you know, I, I've been able to go through it personal, uh, personally, from my sister, and you know, uh, <laughs> my mom and me are out here supporting it, supporting her. So she's here to have a good time to spread the awareness for the for the uh, cause and. Hope to get the awareness out to the country. Have you been, we've heard that there's this really 3D interactive brain thing out there that you can walk through and learn more about the brain and epilepsy. Have you seen the brain yet? I haven't seen it, but <laughs> I, I want to see it because I did hear about it, but I haven't seen it yet. So sooner or later, you know, when we get to it, I hope to go in and learn a little bit. Yeah, so people that go out there today can yeah. like actually, the kids will really enjoy that. Actually, I think I would enjoy that. Yeah, it's, yeah. it's, it's, it's almost perfect for Halloween, walking through a giant brain. It sounds <laughs> right. uh, very, uh, now, now, folks want to know how you're feeling about the season and, and, and the game. Uh, what do you think of this morning? Uh, you know, we're doing good. We're doing real good. We're doing what we have to do. I mean, uh, that was a big one yesterday. So just proud of that, proud of the way our team responded. And, you know, we just got to keep it pushing and stay consistent. Brett, one thing, uh, you know, it, your sister has, has, has epilepsy, and you've had to deal with that, and she has in your mom, your entire family for many years. What's the one thing you would like viewers to know about, um, about epilepsy? Um, that is something serious. I mean, it's, you know, people who don't know what it is really wouldn't know until they saw it firsthand and, and sort of got to experience it. So it's, it's something real serious. I mean, it affects a lot of individuals throughout this country. And it's, it's, it's a scary thing. I mean, most people wouldn't want to see somebody go through that. And I mean, just seeing my sister go through something like that is, it's, it's hard. But I mean, you know, uh, we just got to, well, that's why we're out here, you know, to support the cause and, and uh, build research and, and uh, try to get the funding uh, to, you know, just just get the reason and, 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 and get the reason, you know, everything everything is for it. And now, Paris, I'm not sure, it, it, it is your sister, right? Does she, do you have, can you hear us? Yes. Oh, great. Hi, Paris. Good morning. Hey, so we were just wondering, too, um, you know, I, when did you find out that you had epilepsy? Were you a young child or just recently? Um, no, I was about 11. And what were your symptoms? I was about 11 when I found out. Mm -hmm. uh, actually, I didn't have no symptoms. I was getting ready to go get a um, scholar athlete award, and I just fell into a seizure. And supposedly, my brother went through the apartment screaming, help. He thought I was dead or dying. Mm -hmm. <laughs> What a scary thing. Uh, I, I, now, now, now the good thing is that he's learned, he's trained, should it happen again, uh, you'll be in good hands, yeah? Yes. Oh, thank you all so much. It's so nice to meet your family as well, Brent. Thank you so much for joining us live. We hope you have a good event out there today. Looks beautiful out at the Rose Bowl. Starts at 945 officially here. If you want to register, there's the website on your screen. Boy, that, that, that's really neat to see uh, You know him getting involved in something so personal to his family. Yeah, he's got a voice and he's using it. Yeah, that's for darn sure. Great. Uh, may I show you?